Well, just got done eating dinner. And I think that it's supposed to be sunny tomorrow. That's what they're forecasting anyhow. I'm gonna use the skid steer and uh, finish cleaning out the barn, throw it in the manure spreader, and get it on the garden so I can till it in. That way we can plant the garden tomorrow evening. Because that's the game plan.
we're pretty much done spreading manure. You can see the tractor back here. Grab the leaf blower real quick. I'm gonna go blow this out. Morning everyone. See, manure has been spread all over. Maybe a little thick here, but been spread all over the garden. We will use the tiller. We actually borrowed uh we don't have a replacement tractor for the 5020 yet. We borrowed a neighbor's small tractor so we can use the tiller. But all this will get tilled in and then we will be ready to plant. Last night we cleaned the barn up, right? And we spread all of our uh, spread all the manure in the garden. It's tilled in now. Obviously, there's some lumps here and there where I was turning around or what have you. And I ended up staying in one spot for too long. I can spread that or even that out with a rake. That's not a hard hard thing to do. However, what I couldn't understand is why I was low on hydraulic fluid on the skid steer because I did have a leak at the back on the engine oil. I was aware of that. Well, it turns out they put a new hose on here. Actually, they put two of them on. Um, they put this one on right here, and they put this one on. This was the previous owners. Well, it would seem that this fitting right here is just not as tight as it needs to be. So I'm gonna go ahead and attempt to tighten her down and uh, see what we can do there. I don't know if I can get the name. I had to use cheater bar to begin with. So I'm assuming I'm gonna need a cheater bar for the remainder of it too. Yeah? Ah, oh, Kevin. 